New DS7 Crossback 2018 Review The all-new DS7 Crossback SUV has arrived to rival the BMW X1, Audi Q3 and Volvo XC40, but is it a contender? Since arriving as a brand in its own right in 2014, DS has treaded water in Europe with a selection of rebranded cars carried over from its days under the Citroen badge. Four years later, PSA is ready to push the mark out into the wild, so it's no surprise to see that the first original DS model to hit European showrooms competes in the ultra-competitive small premium SUV space. The DS7 Crossback is pitched as being an avant-garde alternative to the likes of the Range Rover Evoque and Audi Q3, but it leaps right into the deep end of the market against other newcomers. As an indicator of just how busy this segment is the DS7 has the latest BMW X1, plus the all-new Jaguar E-Pace and Volvo XC40 for Company 2. With such strong competition, the DS7 Crossback needs to stand out to avoid being swamped by its talented rivals. To that extent, DS hopes that the DS7 can crack the market through a charm offensive. By the end of the year, 60 individual DS dealerships will be established in the UK, with a distinct focus on tailored customer service. To drive, the DS7 Crossback boasts safe rather than sharp characteristics. Body roll is kept relatively in check, but the steering is soft and numb, and isn't improved by toggling the car into its sport mode, which also introduces some bizarre sound actuation from the speakers in the cabin, not welcome considering the 2.0-liter diesel driven here can't shake a coarse engine note. It's best to stick the cross back into comfort, and enjoy the full benefits of the decent cruising speed ride, only improved by the 19-inch wheels on this car and the addition of active scan suspension. At low speeds though, the ride can become a little unsettled. Performance isn't really what the DS7 Crossback is about, but the 2.0-liter diesel serves up decent punch thanks to 400 newton meters of torque. DS claims 0 to 62 miles per hour in 9.9 .9 seconds, which is competitive in this segment. Space up front in the cockpit is good, and both driver and front seat passenger won't have any trouble getting comfortable. In the back, legroom and headroom is generous and a flat floor means that a middle seat passenger shouldn't be too troubled for space too. However, that flat floor feels a bit shallow, which isn't ideal for taller passengers. As a trade-off, the 555 liter boot is good for this class. What will prove to be this car's make or break point is its price tag. Though a new entrant into this segment, you'll pay for the high level of standard equipment with a list price and monthly finance offerings that places it directly in the firing line of the new BMW X320DM Sport, and above the Volvo XC40D3R design, both of which are all-wheel drive as standard too. Key Specs Model, DS7 Crossback Performance Line Blue D180 Price, £36,335 Engine 2.0 liter 4 sil turbo diesel. Power slash torque, 178 bhp slash 400 newton meters. Transmission, 8 speed automatic. Front wheel drive, 0 to 62 miles per hour, 9.9 .9 seconds. Top speed, 134 miles per hour. Economy, CO2, 57.6 miles per gallon slash 128 grams slash km. On sale. Now, 